I'm going to be talking about the transition from a volunteer community to a semi-professional, semi-paid organization in the context of Wikipedia community organization. How do you do? My name is Lane Raspberry. I edit as Blue Raspberry. I do Wikipedia at the School of Data Science at the University of Virginia. And with the things that I do, I interact with a lot of Wikipedia communities. The situation is that when Wikipedia was established, it was a volunteer project. There wasn't money, there weren't donations coming in, some time has passed. Now there's donations available and there's a mission but behind the entire Wikimedia movement. We're trying to provide the best content to the most people, get everybody involved, many diverse perspectives. There's a lot we want to accomplish. And wouldn't it be nice if now that donations are coming in, we could allocate those donations strategically where people are people volunteers are doing good work and we could expedite and multiply and amplify their work there's a challenge in that if you give money to volunteers and they have no staff it's very hard for them to hire people do reporting make strategic planning be a nonprofit organization or do administration for, for all these things that they want to do. Uh, part of the reason is because the reasons why people come to Wikipedia as volunteers, uh, they want to edit articles, they want to upload pictures, they like debating content in the articles. These are unrelated to corporate administration and just because you're a good Wikipedia editor doesn't mean that you would very much enjoy the administrative side of things. <clears throat> There's books about this in management. Sometimes this is called crossing the chasm. Imagine that there's a large canyon and you know that you want to cross it, but there's no infrastructure there, no bridges, no way across. It's very resource intensive to make that conversion. Once the bridge is built, people can easily go back and forth. But how do you build the initial bridge and how do you do this wisely? We can't build bridges everywhere. We want to do it with the groups that can make the most impact and can properly administer things. And there's been a lot of contention and hurt feelings, crying, screaming, uh, unfortunate situations where communities of people who did just find as wiki volunteer editors have been given money and they have high ambitions, but not the administrative support and they don't successfully cross the canyon. Actually, they fall in. And that's very unfortunate. We don't want anyone to, 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 to fall in when they're trying to cross this canyon. So I'm going to say something from the wiki community perspective, a, a particular problem that I see arising often. And I'd like to open this up for more discussion. It seems like one of the perils. And the, the peril is that you have wiki community volunteers who are interacting with grant officers. And I'll, I'll tell you, grants administration is its own professional field. And most of the people who work in grants administration, they're unaccustomed to giving grants to people who are volunteers and asking them to, to cross the canyon to set up administration. So lots of grants get awarded in the world, but the expertise in that field, it doesn't often apply to what's going on in the Wikipedia volunteer community. And so it can happen that there's a grant officer and they'll accept a grant proposal, a request for funding from Wikimedia community volunteers. And what the, what the volunteers will say is, we're gonna get everybody together, we're gonna edit some Wikipedia articles, we're gonna do a campaign where we ask people to upload photos around a particular theme. Uh, we're gonna do editor recruitment, we're gonna train people, what, whatever the program is, there's, there's all kinds of programs that happen. And they'll write up their proposal and they've discussed this with the community and there comes a time, they submit the proposal, goes to the, the grant officer. And then the grant officer, as grant officers do, and this is completely normal, this is something that would be appropriate to happen like this in any other context, but it's, it's perilous in Wikipedia. The grant officer will begin negotiation. They'll say, can you make this change? Can you make this change? Sometimes the, the negotiations, the ideas, they come from the grant officer themselves. Sometimes the ideas, they come from Wikipedia community peer review. But nevertheless, there's a, there's a power imbalance here and that somebody's got money, some, uh, another community wants some money. <laughs> can, we, can we transfer this money? And, and what, it, what is negotiated at the end? Here's the intervention that I would like that would make this much less dangerous. 
if a community has already deliberated, they have a grant proposal, community members, volunteers, organizations, or even individuals, they've made their proposal and anybody wants to negotiate, then along with the negotiation, the person asking for the changes to the original proposal has to give their personal estimate of how long they think it would take to do all the additional things that they're requesting. I'll give you an example. Supposing that wiki community members say we're going to organize a wiki editing party, an event. We're going to rent a community center. We're going to have coffee and cookies to entice people to come. We're going to have Wikipedia training and then everybody's going to edit Wikipedia articles. This is the community's idea. This is the way they like to do things. And then the grant officer says, oh, that's a great idea. But can you also provide metrics? Can you determine what is the Im impact of, of this event? And that might be fine. Wikipedia is a digital platform. There's buttons that anyone can press and they can collect metrics and then they can report those metrics. And just as long as the metrics are the kind that Wikipedia is already designed to collect, things can go very well. But where things get off the rail is supposing someone, the grant officer says, can you collect metrics? And there are no tools in Wikipedia to collect these. So you've got to come up with a program to collect these and we need them to be valid and we need you to report them and interpret the significance of these metrics. So some common kind of metrics that get requested are can you do a gender survey of everyone in attendance at the event? Can you determine the genders of people who were stakeholders in the kind of content uh, that you're producing? Can you do other demographic surveys? Can you determine uh, race? Uh, if they have indigenous status, can you determine if they identify in any community whatsoever that could be demographically interpreted and counted? And when you do this, we'd also like you to describe the extent to which the demographics of people who participated in your program match the demographics of the community that you're trying to reach. Like, is, is there bias in your program? What's, what's going on here? So wiki community members, when money's on the line, they're volunteers and they'd like to get their grant and they don't have a lot of negotiate, negotiation skills, sometimes they'll just say yes to anything, which is, which is unfortunate because they're making negotiations at the last minute. They don't know if they can actually do these kinds of things. They don't know how long it would take. It wasn't part of the original plan. And to be asked to do something at the last minute uh, it can bring a lot of uncertainty into it. So supposing somebody wants metrics for a wiki community program, what could that mean? So there's, there's so many ways to describe it, but if you put it in terms of labor hours, then that more clearly communicates what's going on here. So if the officer says, I'd like you to write a report, here's all my complicated requirements for the report, who cares what they are, my expectation is that this report will take about 10 hours to do then the community, no matter how complicated the report is, they know if they've invested about 10 hours in it, then the report must be the, the quality that's being requested of them. Maybe some things are impossible, but they can always say, well, <clears throat> they must want us to just make up things or give our opinions for, for these kinds of things that they're asking because they can't possibly expect that we can do all these things that they requested in 10 hours. Alternatively, maybe the grant officer says this is going to take another 100 hours in which case the wiki community member, they're gonna say, okay, 100, 100 hours, we're gonna to have to hire staff for that. We're gonna need a budget allocation, particularly for the, these kinds of metrics and reports that are being requested of us. And 100 hours, that's only enough time to try to collect some numbers. That's not gonna be enough time to uh, robustly interpret them or do research to see what other people have done in the past. Going beyond 100 hours, the grant officers might say, these, these are really important numbers. We need you to do what you can to make sure that these are right. We, we actually want to showcase this report somewhere. People are going to read it. This isn't just an internal report. This is, this is very serious. And we need you to not only do the report and collect these extra met metrics and do this kinds of administrative reporting, but we also need you to report how you're doing the administrative reporting. What is your methodology? And in that case, you're talking about hundreds of extra hours in the program. 
I've often seen in the Wikipedia community, I, I really respect Wikipedia's values for promoting diversity, but it often happens that in the course of promoting diversity, Wiki community members commit to responsibilities that seem to me and that are often interpreted to be greater than the greater than the amount of labor that would be necessary to do the original program. If Wiki community members want to start keeping people's personal data, for example, ask them what is your race, what is your gender, your LGBT status, are you an indigenous community, do you have religious affiliation, these other kinds of things, you need an IRB, an institutional review board, to start collecting this data. You're at the point of doing human subject research, and any university in the world would require you get ethical review, the, review for these kinds of things. If Wiki community members are doing this, it seems like a nice idea. Of course we want diversity, but diversity isn't something that can be taken lightly. Diversity isn't sprinkles on an ice cream cone if you have something nice you just add diversity to it. It's something that has to be strategically planned. Uh, it's something that community groups have to plan with each other. No group can design their own diversity program. It needs to be coordinated across the movement. And it's not something to be taken lightly because if someone misspeaks or says the wrong thing, it, it propagates misinformation about the extent of our accomplishments in the Wikimedia movement. It's very serious that we, we get these things right. Takeaway of all of this is that it's there's some power di power disparity whenever community members who have not yet crossed the chasm negotiate on matters of money. The way that community members get compromised in this is that the administrators, the grant administrators, the people who can award money to community members will begin to ask them for things without being clear about how big of an ask it is. So, if you're a community member and someone asks you for something, here's how you negotiate this. Say, how long should this take? Very simple. And if you're a, a grant officer and you're asking things of community members, just be proactive and say, here are the additional requests and put a number of hours near each one and also fund them for those extra hours. Thank you so much for hearing me out. Happy to talk about grants administration in the Wikipedia space anytime.